the way I describe it is we are movement experts. Uh, we really pay attention and focus on how a person moves and how a person moves. There are so many different things that go into that. And we work with that in a plethora of different ways, whether it's orthopedics, neurologic, oncology, women's health, whatever it is to help people get moving the best way as possible or back to moving as, as best they can. That is basically what we do. Um, there was a guy in my senior year, he was a sophomore, got in a pretty bad car accident that unfortunately left him paralyzed from the chest down. And the football coach was one of my teachers and he was very close with, with this guy at the time and talked about his physical therapy. I had no idea that someone who suffered a spinal cord injury could go through physical therapy because I always thought, oh, you tear your ACL, you hurt your elbow, you go to physical therapy. I had no idea that there is a whole neurologic side of it. So from that experience or that story that was kind of close to me, I had this interest in neurologic PT. And we have a group chat all the time, so everyone's always asking questions in there, making sure we're wearing the right things to class, we're, we're going to the right classes, and we have a shared Google Drive. Like we're From the very beginning, we were all about, we're in this together, it's no longer a competition, it's just, let's all get through this, let's all get through and be PTs together. I love how close the faculty is with us students. They're very good at making us feel like a family. All the faculty, they are certified in different various areas in PT. So if you want to specialize in oncology, women's health, orthopedics, neurologic, geriatrics, whatever it is, we likely have someone in our program who is certified and is more than willing to talk to you about what that tract is like and how to go about doing it. The Sims Lab is one of the things that definitely made me think I need to come here because Getting that experience in a very safe way where you can mess up here. Getting that, that experience is huge because you can learn something hands-on without feeling like, oh, I'm going to mess up and hurt someone. And you can learn from those experiences before you go out and work with actual patients and actual populations.